Now, it looks like a brick and it's creating a buzz. A team of Americans and Kenyans has developed a new internet router that is affordable and reliable for people without consistent web access. Michael Scaturo has more. Eric Hersman and his team in Nairobi have created what they say is the first router made especially for Africa. It's battery powered and rugged. Brick was born out of our frustration with trying to stay connected to the internet. And is gaining attention in Europe and the United States. In just a week, the team has met half of its cash target on the fundraising website kickstarter.com. Hersman gave a keynote speech about the Brick at the Republica Tech Conference. What we have right here is the version 6 prototype, but it'll be decreasing in size already. It's about this footprint and, and thinner. The Brick device works with unreliable power and unreliable internet to provide connectivity to entire villages. Blogger Al Banda of Cameroon said he saw the device for the first time this week in Berlin. The device drew his attention because it could solve an issue that he has experienced. In Cameroon, in my community, for example, it's extremely relevant. We constantly have uh, power outages, you know, and you, and you won't get access to the internet. We constantly have the ISPs for any random reasons not um, providing the service they actually claim they're providing us. So uh, a solution like that is just, you know, it's, it's, it's just, uh, you know, an, an African answer to an African problem. James Clardy, a venture consultant from Texas, said he's already bought himself a brick and he thinks it might be a hit in developed countries as well. I'm exploring uses of these technologies for building automation, for telehealth, tele telemedicine. So having a portable device that can hook equipment to the internet is of value to me as a technology developer. Hersman says the device works on any available internet or power sources. If you have an internet connection problem, it'll fail over to a SIM card, so you have 3G connectivity, which means that you can also just completely unplug it and take it with you wherever you go and, and have connectivity along the way. Hersman told audiences at Republica that production will start when the company meets its Kickstarter goal of 125,000 US dollars. The company plans to make 500 to 1,500 devices during the first production run, with most devices going to Africa and India. Each device is slated to cost around 100 US dollars. Michael Scutoro for VOA News in Berlin.